So I'm still totally thrilled about the Kickstarter campaign. Uh, you know, over 500% funded. I'm starting to learn more about the 500 plus people, the 500 of you who are part of this. Um, and start, you know, digging more into making this stuff happen. I think it's, it's easy to imagine that when you're working on a, a solution to the changing climate, that it's going to be really kind of glamorous or very like environmental a mix of like minority report and a beautiful mind. And then there's the climate, right? And the reality is so much of this comes back to the things, the things I'm doing are, uh, you know, chasing down DHL and learning about international shipments from Switzerland to Canada to the United States for carbon dioxide, uh, learning about uh, printer paper sizing and scaling. So, uh, this, this past week for the, for the negative bracelet, uh, we sent out 500 plus sizing sheets, it's just a PDF, but enabling people to be able to figure out their wrist size if they don't have a tape measure at home and something you can print that then you know what the size is, right? How is that related to climate action? Well, it's to figure out, you know, the, the size of your wrist so you can have the negative bracelet. You can start climate conversations with other people and, and to be a part of taking carbon out of the air. So, it's, it's, I think that's, that's really where it's at. If, if you're working on understanding things with you know, DHL distributors and things like that, or, or you're wrangling graphic design and a printer and you're like, oh man, how do I, how do I get into climate action? The truth is it's, just, it's, the, it's the, the same skills, but you're just going to be applying them to, to the climate or you're going to be applying them to, to some sort of solution. Uh, and so, so that's, that's what I've been up to. And that's, that's all a part of making negative a success. I think that this whole adventure is all part of better understanding the climate, better understanding, uh, how this all works and understanding how to, how to pull a heck of a lot of carbon from the atmosphere.